what's up everybody welcome back to the channel guys today we're going to be discussing the first time and how Leroy is adding more songs to the track list before we get into that if you guys haven't seen i've been on the road to 50k subscribers for a minute now so if you're new here drop a sub it would help out the channel a lot and with that out of the way we're gonna dive into the video i do want to give a shout out to the kid Leroy updates link to this twitter will be in the description down below because they dm me all of the news that we need to cover but just to give a little Little backstory real quick Leroy started going live on twitch again so we ended up getting new snippets he played what just happened songs that aren't on the album he played quite a few things and just gave us overall album news the first thing I'm gonna show you guys is Leroy saying that what just happened is confirmed dropping in March and so is the album release date yes what just happens is 1000% coming this month um <clears throat> it's really just as soon as as soon as the um as soon as the video gets done to be honest that's all um that's really what what it is the songs done the songs mixed um pretty sure it's mastered and pretty sure everything's ready to go so I also want to point out that during the stream, a snippet called After Everything was played, but this song is confirmed to not be dropping on the first time. I just wanted to clear that up in case anybody was wondering about that song. This next piece of news isn't 100% confirmed, but Leroy did say he's thinking about putting together an EP full of songs that will not be on the album. This EP will either release on SoundCloud or BandLab before or after the album drops. Um. I do want to maybe drop a couple songs maybe at some point before or after the album, just shit that I'm not using on the album on SoundCloud or on that uh, Bandlab page or something like that. Um, but don't take that for gospel please <laughs> just uh, i'm i've been thinking about it though i just put together a little a little ep j just for you guys though Regarding the first time track list as well, Leroy goes on to say that his original plan was to put 10 songs on one half and then 10 songs on another half. It sounds like he is still wanting to do the side A and side B, but he's saying that at least the first side is going to have more songs because we've been waiting so long for the album. You guys are asking how many songs? Well, there was an original plan to do like uh, two sides of the album, so it was going to be like... Um it was gonna originally be like 10 songs on the first side, 10 songs on the, on the second side. Um, but I'm thinking about maybe, I'm thinking about maybe doing, doing more songs on the first side. Uh, I'm just in the middle of, I, I'm, I'm in the middle of, of, of finalizing that and figuring it out just cause, um, just cause you guys have been waiting for, for so long, so. I do want to <clears throat> I do want to honor you guys in that way and say thank you for for sticking with me. This last thing I want to look at, Leroy updates wasn't able to get a video of it, but they did DM me saying that Leroy has around 2 weeks to finish and turn in the album officially, so before it's due, considering that what just happened isn't out yet, we're most likely not going to be getting the album before the tour on March 22nd or even this month at all, but we will probably be seeing it released in April. Just to recap that because I know that's a lot of news. It sounds like the first first half of the first time is going to have more songs on it than 10 because of the extended wait. Keep in mind that Guess It's Love is not on the album and Kids Are Growing Up is going to be one full song when the album does drop. Unfortunately, we're not going to be getting it this month because it sounds like Leroy doesn't even have to turn the album in until basically mid-March. But that does hopefully mean that, like Kid Leroy Update said, April or May at the absolute latest, I feel like we would get the first time. Leroy's been moving quick with dropping the singles and after what just happened once we do get that, that's the last single and we're confirmed to be getting the release date this month as well so it really does seem like April is the month that it's gonna drop. With all that being said, thank you guys for watching. If we get any more Leroy news, I'm gonna be the first one to bring it to you. Drop a sub if you're new here and with that being said, we'll see you in the next one.